it's time to review vowels and consonants. The letters in the alphabet divide into two types of sounds. Do you remember what we call them? Vowels and consonants. Depending on the particular sound we wish to make, we change the flow of air. Vowels depend on the unrestricted flow of air through the mouth. The mouth stays open for vowel sounds. What do consonants depend on? Consonants depend on the restricted flow of air. How is the airflow restricted for consonants? It's restricted using the tongue, teeth, and lips. Which of the two types can last longer? Vowel sounds can last longer. In fact, they can last as long as there is breath because the mouth is open. Which of the two types was described as the foundation sound of a word or part of a word? Vowels. In fact, there are three words that consist of just a vowel. Do you remember the words? O, I, and a. Uh. How many of the 26 letters in the alphabet are vowels? Five. Name the five letters that are always vowels. A, E, I, O, and U. Why are the vowels the most versatile letters in the alphabet? That's because the five vowels combine in different ways to create 16 of the 44 sounds in English. Can a consonant stand alone as a word? No, in English, consonants are always joined by one or more vowels. Can consonants combine with other consonants in words? Yes. In fact, some of these consonants create new sounds. We will learn these in step two. Is it possible for a consonant to act like a vowel? Yes, there are some tricky consonants that work as vowels in certain situations. Consonants control the flow of air as we say a word. How does that affect our speech? When the air stops, the sound stops. Is this the primary job of consonants? Yes, these letters create clear starts and stops in words and word parts. Some of the 21 consonants are voiceless. What does that mean? Some consonants are not actually spoken. Their sound is created by a puff of air. What do we call the consonants that are actually spoken? These are called voiced consonants. Now that you remember the facts about vowels and consonants, let's begin the review. You will see a letter for three seconds. Say its name and whether it is a vowel or a consonant before the answer appears. Z, consonant. N, consonant. F, consonant. A, vowel. V, consonant. P, consonant. K, consonant. E, vowel. M, consonant. S, consonant.
Y, consonant. L, consonant. C, consonant. I, vowel. W, consonant. Q, consonant. H, consonant. D, consonant. O, vowel. J, consonant. X, consonant. R, consonant. G, consonant. U, vowel. B, consonant. T, consonant. If you made more than three mistakes, review the letters again. If you made only three or fewer mistakes, just pay special attention to those letters.